Good morning, students. In the last video, we have constructed the B tree with order four and the same elements. I did not change the elements, but in place of four, here in this example, I have given three nodes. For we will solve this question for your better understanding. If the order is three, we will not worry about the number of children. Solve these things. We will worry how many keys will be there. Minimum number of keys at the root node is one. Okay. And maximum is p minus one, so two keys are possible. So minimum is one key and maximum is two keys. And what about internal nodes? Internal nodes will have p by two, okay, minus one to p minus one keys. So it is three by two. C is nothing but two minus one to. 3 minus 1, so which is equal to 1 to 2 keys. So internal node can also have 1 to 2 keys, means minimum is 1 and maximum is 2 keys. Okay, and the leaf node also will have same 1 minimum and maximum is 2 keys. So when we have taken the order 3, all the nodes will have minimum 1 key and maximum 2 keys. So we have found that what is the minimum number of keys and what is the maximum number of keys all the nodes will have. So now we will start constructing the B tree. Okay. So maximum I can have two, so I will take the two spaces. Okay. So first I want to insert six, so I will insert six here. Then I have to insert ten. I will insert here because there is space, so there is no problem. Now I want to insert five. So the element should be in increasing order. So I have to keep the five here. So five, six, ten. But can I insert five here? No, I cannot insert because it will be an overflow condition. If it is an overflow condition, what we have to do? We have to take the median. Median here it is six. So promote the six to the parent node and keep the five to the left sub tree and ten to the right sub tree. Okay, sorry, the board is making a lot of noise. And the twenty, so I can erase this one. Now I want to insert twenty. Twenty where it will come? Twenty is greater than six and greater than ten, so twenty will come here. Okay, as there is a space, I can insert twenty here. Okay, we have inserted up to twenty. Now I want to insert eight. Eight is greater than six, so obviously it will come to the right sub tree. And eight is less than ten, so it will come here. But can I insert here? No, I cannot insert here because it is in overflow condition. If it is in overflow condition, what should I do? I have to take the median and promote it to the parent node. So parent node will consist of now six and ten are the root node. In this case, this is also a root node five, eight, and twenty. Is it clear? So, where is the list? Give me one minute. I will take the list. So I will erase this one. So six, ten, five, eight, twenty are there. So whether any overflow at the root node, no, it can have up to two keys. So two keys are there. It is not a problem. So now I want to insert twenty-six. Where the twenty-six will come? Twenty-six is greater than ten and greater than twenty. Twenty-six I need to insert here. Okay. It is not a overflow condition, so no problem. Twenty-six I have inserted. Now I want to insert eleven. Eleven is greater than ten and less than twenty, so eleven will come here. I cannot insert eleven here, so I have to take the median and promote it to the parent node. If I promote it, it will looks like six, ten, twenty. Okay, six, ten, twenty will be like this. Now. We construct it. Six, ten, twenty. It will be there, and five, eight will be there here, and eleven, and twenty-six is here. Now, if you see, can I insert twenty here? I cannot insert twenty here because maximum it can have two, but in this case it have three. Then what should I do? Again, I have to take the median. That is what the step three says. Recursively, you have to calculate the median and promote it to the parent node. 
So again, I will calculate the median. In this case, the median is 10. So 10 is my root node, and 6 is left subtree, and 20. Then you will have 5 this side, 8 is here. Now, where the 11 will come? 11 is greater than 10, less than 20, so it will be attached to here, and 26 will come here. Are you able to understand it or not? So we have finished up to 11. Now I want to insert 7. So 7 is less than 10, greater than 6, and less than 7. Sorry, less than 8. So it will be inserted here. 7 we can insert here. There is no problem. Please remember one thing. Always you have to insert the elements at the appropriate leaf nodes only. Not at the parent level or at the internal level. If it is an overflow, then you have to promote it to the parents and finally it can reach up to the root node. Okay, so please remember that point. So 7 I have inserted successfully. Now I want to insert 30. 30 is greater than 10, greater than 20, greater than 26. So I will insert here. Okay, so whether any overflow? No. So this is the completion of constructing the B tree with an order 3 with the following elements. I hope you are understanding the all my videos. If you have any doubts, you are free to ask me in the comment section. I will clear your doubts. Thank you so much for listening the lecture. And I request everyone, please like the video if you are really learning the new things and share with your friends so that your friends also can learn the things and subscribe to the, my channel for regular updates. Thank you so much.